Welcome back to my kitchen. Same one from the other night. <laughs> um, tonight we are kicking. This is the fourth meal in our $30 a week meal planning challenge. And tonight we're having enchiladas. Let me show you the ingredients. I'm filming this on a Saturday and there's a lot of people in the park. So you're going to hear cars and vehicles and people. And Anyway, here are the ingredients. I'm going to cook all the turkey tonight, but I'm only going to use half of it. Tomorrow night I'll use the other half, but I'm going to go ahead and cook it. Um, I'm going to use the flour tortillas. So they're not going to be corn enchiladas. They're going to be flour tortillas. And... I don't have the spices out here. I will put the spices that I use in the description below. But here's some of the leftover cheese that we had from the last two meals we had with cheese. I'm going to go ahead and grate this up. I'll need it in one more meal. I'm going to cook the rest of the rice. I'm going to add some black beans, half of this can, and a little bit of this can because I'm using this again tomorrow night. So that's how you... Use up all your ingredients when you buy them and nothing goes to waste. You plan meals around the same ingredients. So um, let's get cooking because the rice is going to take a little while. I think it's going to start raining again. I've been battling the rain all day to try to get this cooked. All right. So I got the charcoal going. I'm going to cook these enchiladas in the Dutch oven. So I got the charcoal going. I'm going to split this in half. So I can season part of it for the enchiladas tonight. And the other will be for tomorrow night. And the rice is cooking. Don't open that. <laughs> And I'm going to add a little bit of these diced tomatoes. I think I want to drain some of that. I want all that juice in there. Okay, I drained some of that off. I think that's enough. Add some rice. Rice is done. Okay, I added the rice. Now I'm going to add the seasonings. And then we'll stuff the tortillas and get it in the Dutch oven. Okay, this is going to be my enchilada sauce. Homemade. I'll put the ingredients down below. Need to add a couple. I think I'm going to heat it up first. Okay, I warmed it up a little bit and stirred it all together. Let the flour cook a little bit. I'm going to add oop, about a cup, cup and a half of water. Do you want more enchilada sauce? Add more water. That'd be dinner. And cook. And on the mixture, you can put any kind of spices you want. Taco seasoning. I have some home, well, it's fine ground pepper. No, this is homemade pinto bean seasoning. So I'm going to use just a little bit of that. You don't need much. Starting to thicken up. Just stir it, don't let it burn and let it thicken. Okay, the coals are just about ready. Tortilla. These are flour tortillas, they're not the authentic corn tortilla. I'm using the leftover cheese. All right, let's add the enchilada sauce. Homemade enchilada sauce right here. Mm -hmm. Okay, 
rest of the leftover cheese and a little bit of fresh grated from today. Mm. Okay, this is what we have left over of the mixture. It'll be good with some an egg and cheese burrito or another enchilada. Could do a whole nother recipe with a whole nother dish with that. Okay, I'd have a lot of coals on there because they got small while I was preparing everything else. But let's look. Let's look inside. Everything's cooked. It just needs to heat up. Marry and melt the cheese and oh yeah. That's looking good. I'd say it's ready. I'm going to let it go a little bit more just to heat up the inside. Can y'all see that? There's a cross up there on the very top of that rock. And there's a, some guy up there. Well, some kid. That's a way, a long way up there. Look at that. Crazy. Okay, we're ready to eat. We think it's good and done. Oh, yeah. Look at that bubbly goodness. Take that off. Take it off the cold so we'll quit cooking. You ready? Oh my goodness, I am so ready. Jana, this looks so great. Let's see. Maybe I'll try to just one first. Yeah. These meals you're doing on this budget are incredible. Mmm. <laughs> mmm. -hmm. Mm -hmm. Cheesy goodness. Yes, it is. Thank you. Well, what's the verdict? Honestly, uh oh, I'm, I'm not joking. Best enchilada. I've ever had. Ooh. No joke. It's with flour tortillas, too. Yeah, no joke. You like them better with corn or flour? Whatever this is. <laughs> she says, this is it. All right, here's mine. Cheese is melted good. Mmm. That is good. It's that sauce. I'm telling you that. Homemade enchilada sauce with, those are just spices. That's what's amazing to me. Mm. <laughs> that is good. I'll cook these again. <laughs> Easy and cheap, frugal. All right, I'm gonna get off here and finish eating these enchiladas. But stay tuned for tomorrow's video with the leftover taco meat. That's going to be a lot of leftovers, too, on that meal. So stay tuned for that one. Really? You want food? Oh. Oh. You, like, you want enchilada? You want an enchilada? Okay. I'll get you an enchilada.